Good morning, besties. Happy Tuesday. I almost said Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. I am finally feeling so much better today. I have been, let me put this in my bag somewhere. My SIM card. I'll just drop it in there. I have been feeling so, I have been having a headache for literally like a week and I don't, didn't know what it was. Get ready to not finding my I feel like this G7X is broken. I know it is, the lenses at least, because it can never find me. Bro, focus on me. Focus on me. I don't usually get pimples that much anymore since I went gluten free and I changed my. <coughs> Why does that always happen to me? Since I went gluten free, and I changed my skincare. I don't usually get these big pimples anymore, but I guess it is. Gosh, that was straight up my nose. My best friend Chelsea came back to train yesterday, so that was really exciting because I hadn't seen her in like a month because she's been sick. And so that just made my whole week because I know I'm gonna see her multiple times this week. So that's exciting. Um, both my employees will not be working today. Our Wi-Fi went out yesterday, that was annoying. Hopefully it's still on. I haven't had anybody call me to tell me otherwise and they would, so that's a good thing. So let's go, let's go work out. I just finished my workout just finished my workout um, it was kind of an easier day no I did that yesterday what the heck anyway it was kind of an easier day um, which is helpful I've started to not um, work out as hard as I can every single day I have started to not work out as hard as I can every single day because um, that's actually counterproductive. <laughs> I am going to be completely honest with you. As a trainer, there are some rules, and I feel like other trainers can relate to this. There are th some rules and some things that I tell my clients that are true, <laughs> that are universally known, but I will do something else because um it's hard to follow the rules sometimes and i'll give you an example about that like working out for example you know i will tell my clients and this is true and i believe this like i will tell them you need to weight train at least three times a week but you should not be weight training more than five but there was definitely a time when I was telling people that and I was working out seven days a week and um, I think it has more to do with my mental health obviously than my physical health because I love the gym and it's always been I've been working out since I'm 16 and it has always been like my happy place like I've just always loved it but I have abused it at times and I just mean like you know going to the gym and working out it gives it gives the endorphins it really does but um, sometimes it's too much and you're actually working against yourself and you're not gonna achieve the goals that you're looking for and the way that I've justified that, like like I said with my clients, is I've been like, sorry, I had to put my light a little closer. Is I've been like, well, they're just trying to get a little bit healthier. I'm trying to be like superior, which that sounds bad, but it's true. Most of my clients are just trying to get healthier. They're not trying to be like superior. So, um, and I mean that in terms of like 
bodybuilder style, which I was never trying to be a bodybuilder, but I was like, I'm trying to get close, you know? So anyway, I'm glad today's workout was a little less strenuous. That's, that's the bottom line. I am sitting down. I am sitting down for my lunch. Just did my walking. If you would have told me ever that walking would have been one of my favorite things to do, I would have been like, <laughs> what are you, 80? But it seriously is. It has like changed my fitness altogether. What makes this such a great from Ryan Day. They opened an investigation because somebody collected evidence that, in their opinion... The most glamorous part of this job. Actually, I don't really mind it that much. When people shit all over the toilet, I mind that. Alright, I'm heading out of work. I am headed to the grocery store to get some food. Hi! Alright besties, I'm headed to um, the grocery store. I'm going to pick up... Austin did the grocery shopping for us on Sunday. Um, you know, we're newly married, so we're learning to like live together and we share pretty much all of the responsibilities. Okay, stay. We share pretty much all of like the chores and responsibilities and stuff. Just like whoever needs, whatever needs to get done, gets done. So, um, he did the grocery shopping, long story short. But I forgot to put some stuff on the list. Cause you know, like when you're grocery shopping, you just like remember like, oh yeah, I need that. So I forgot to, um, <laughs> these little boys were doing that to me. <laughs> I forgot to put potatoes and onions on the list. I know this is titillating information, but I'm gonna stop at the store and get them really quickly. I'll say one of my biggest hackity hacks for uh, weight loss or consistency is just do it. I it, I know it's giving Nike, but like I really wanted to just be like, I'll just eat something else besides the potatoes, which I could. I could eat rice, I could eat gluten-free pasta, etc. But I was like, I should eat I should just get the potatoes just stop and get the potatoes it's literally gonna take like two seconds I'm gonna get the onions which is gonna make my chicken taste better so anyway long story short I'm stopping at the store making some dinner we're having little potatoes and burgers and a, probably a side salad Cooking burgers on the blog, Angel. Ooh. I'm gonna have an amazing vlog. Just got the hot pots, some burgers with grilled onions, and the lettuce. We're just gonna eat this up. What are we gonna watch? Better Call Saul. Better Call Saul. Only murders. And we'll be back. I thought we already saw that. We can watch it when we have another episode. Oh. I hope it gets better. And we'll be back tomorrow for more of the vlog, okay? Okay. Okay, bye. Okay.
Good morning, besties. Happy Wednesday. I feel so good today. Oh, there was an Amazon box outside. What did I order from Amazon? Please hold. I actually don't need to open it because I know what it is. It's my Halloween costume and my Halloween costume is a surprise. I love Halloween. I had dust out every year, especially at work. I will say I usually go with something ugly or a man. I don't know why, I just think it's funny. I always go for a funny costume. I never go for a pretty costume. This year is the same. It's not a pretty costume, but it's not a boy. So I just like to make people laugh, you know? I like to entertain. It's like my favorite thing ever is when people are like, that is so creative. I'm like, I know, thank you. Okay, that gave me a head rush. Okay, let's make my breakfast. I've been loving my food this week. My meal prep has been on point. Um, I've been having chicken and grilled veggies. Oh, the onions are strong in there. Grilled veggies. Um, sorry, I've been having chicken, grilled, ri <laughs> grilled rice, rice and grilled onions. Jeez. And then for my breakfast, I've just been having eggs and egg whites and jasmine rice. That's like my favorite. Okay, I just filmed a little morning vlog on my Instagram or my TikTok. Probably, it's probably on both. Also, I do it on YouTube Shorts, so if you wanna see a little morning vlog, please go over there. Hydro Drug, use my code LindsayBell10 if you want 10% off. Best water bottle ever because... Can the Stanley do that? Nope. No, it cannot. This keeps the water super cold too. I feel like because it's like closing, it stays colder, I don't know. Okay, we made it to the gym. I'm excited to work out today. Some days I'm not, but today I am. All right, I am doing a full body. Why do people do that? I am doing a full body strength and hypertrophy with mobility workout today. So, starts off with walking lunges. F. So, my friend asked me to do 75 hard with her. And I don't really want to. <laughs> you know why? Because it's hard. <laughs> I don't feel like doing something hard. <laughs> but I feel like that is probably a good reason to do it. So I also really wanted to get more consistent with posting on YouTube and I feel like this will be a good excuse to post. You know, I'll have a good reason to post. I'll have lots of content. Lots of lots of self reflection. You know what the hardest part for me is? Going outside and working out, that's the first one. I wonder if working out in my garage counts. Probably if you're asking, it probably doesn't. <laughs> um, so, uh, what was I saying? Oh, the hardest part for me is reading 10 pages a day. I know that sounds stupid, but it really is hard to do for me. The problem is I need to put down my phone. I also use the excuse that I don't want to like interrupt my husband's life for something I want to do. I mean, he can do it with me if he wants to, but you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to be like, oh, now we have to do X, Y, and Z because I want to do this thing. Even if it's for the better, you know what I mean? 
so but I tell myself that but really I'm not gonna be interrupting anything that he's already doing <laughs> So anyway, yay, 75 hard. I think we're gonna start on Monday. And it, it'll go until December 13th, which is my brother's birthday. Which is a long time. <laughs> 75 days is a long time, bro. I think there's 100 days till the New Year's, so that'll be kind of like a good little challenge. Mind you, this is not a fitness challenge. It's a mental toughness challenge. And that is clarified multiple times. It is not a weight loss challenge. But if you get some mental strength, you can probably lose weight. It's kind of a win-win. So anyway, yay, 75 hard. I'm kind of excited. I've never fully done it. I've done 75 soft. I've never done the hard stuff, so. 75 soft just means you can break the rules, <laughs> which Andy says is not true. It's not, it's not the right, it's not 75 hard. It's something else, so. I feel like I have no excuse. My friend has four kids that's doing it with me, so I have zero. Let's finish getting ready. You guys to do this. You have to have integrity. I'm about to hop on a call with my coach to um, talk about all things supplements so it's exciting um, and then I'm gonna eat my lunch it's very dead in here so it's weird it's a weird day so anyway that's what we're doing today